Turkish Anka-3 successfully fired its first shot. Anka-3, a jet-powered UAV designed by Turkish Aerospace Industries, TAI, successfully made its first shot. The target was hit with the TEBER-82 guidance kit. In the post shared by TAI, it was pointed out that this shot was fired on the 12th sortie of Anka-3, and it was stated that it hit the target from 12 in the 12th sortie. In the statement made by TAI, the following statements were made. Anka-3, the hero of the sky, crowned its first firing with victory. Anka-3, our national engineering marvel unmanned combat aircraft, the pride of the Turkish defense industry, successfully completed its first firing test. The test conducted by Anka-3, which was equipped with a Selsan AF-500 electro-optical camera, was carried out using the Tiber 82 guidance kit developed by Roketsan. The superior performance of Anka-3 in the tests is an indication that it will make a great contribution to the operational capabilities and defense capacity of our country in the future. In the Turkish century, we will continue to serve our rapidly developing defense industry day and night. The development activities of the Anka-3 unmanned combat aircraft, designed by TAI, continue. Anka-3, which has performed many test flights to date, carried ammunition for the first time during its test flight two weeks ago. The fact that the first shot was fired after two weeks shows that the project is progressing at a good pace. Anka-3 Specifications Anka-3 a new generation UAV system will be able to perform many missions such as reconnaissance, surveillance and intelligence. Attack with various air-to-ground munitions, prey detection by engaging enemy helicopters, propeller aircraft and UAVs with air-to-air -air munitions, neutralization of enemy RF emitting radars and air defense systems, protection of friendly forces in the air and on the ground, signal and communications intelligence, electronic warfare, operation with other friendly elements and communication relay. The Anka-3 system will be able to carry 650 kilograms of ammunition in each of the two stations in the fuselage, 650 kilograms in each of the inner wing stations, and 100 kilograms in each of the outer stations. This makes it possible to integrate a wide range of options, from the most commonly used ammunition in today's unmanned aerial vehicles, to large ammunition such as SOMJ, MK-82, and miniature bombs, SDB. Performance data. Maximum cruise speed, Mach 0.7. Base altitude, 40,000 feet. Payload capacity, 1,200 kilograms. Endurance, 10 hours. Thanks for watching. Subscribe Defense Lab's YouTube channel for aviation and defense industry news and updates.